I'm Yvonne, and this is... JJ Guy. <laughs> right. All right. So how old were you when you first started playing music? When I started playing, I started on the fiddle. I was yeah. seven years old. Seven years old. Yeah. Just a wee gaffer. Just a wee one. <laughs> <laughs> and um, who is your biggest musical influence growing up? Uh, my biggest... Well, I had a, s- a series of influences. As, as I matured... <laughs> Uh, I influences changed uh, my beginning influence when I was seven like my older sister played so I wanted to be like my older sister I wanted uh-huh. to play I wanted to play the fiddle like her and I had a great uncle who played so those would be my early influences in playing cool and as I got older um, we had a we had a, a mutual f- a, a friend his name is Vic Mola okay. Vic yeah and uh, he used to stop on tour at our house there and, uh, okay. uh, and so Vic became an influence too and he kind of introduced me to some bluegrass style oh, cool. uh, fiddling and right. he introduced me to Kenny Baker and oh, so right. Kenny Baker became That's amazing a, yeah <laughs> so cool. so Kenny Baker was a huge influence for me in, in my teen teen years nice. I'm trying to copy Kenny Baker and yeah. then as you go along you meet uh, other fiddlers who become influences of course yeah, yeah like absolutely. Yvonne Hernandez oh <laughs> shucks <laughs> cool um where's the most interesting place you've traveled to for music um the, uh, my answer is going to probably sound a lot like Gordon Stovey's answer I I've been up to a lot of little communities in the north that are interesting places I haven't been mm-hmm. uh, that a lot of people don't get to yeah um Bella Coola is really a fascinating place, but I also enjoy, uh, you know, getting out west, getting out east, just being able yeah. to see different parts of the country. Yeah, so, all yeah. over Canada. All over Canada. Canada's Canada. real big. Yeah, yeah absolutely. It's, it's so different. changes too like it depends on I go through spurts of listening to different styles of music yeah so do I <laughs> and so it depends on what style I'm listening to yeah where my favorite fiddler absolutely comes from totally so and I think even different li- listening to different styles that aren't traditionally fiddle styles yeah can help with 
of tune writing. Absolutely. Stuff too, which is, yeah. You write a lot of tunes, and they're yeah, awesome. Yeah, I've been, well, I've been writing yeah. a lot with Gordon yeah. last while. It's so, awesome. Yeah, so you guys have some really fun. cool tunes. Yeah, thanks, Eli. Yeah. Uh, one last crazy weird question. What is your favorite dessert? Favorite dessert? Anything with peanut butter in. I love <laughs> peanut butter. And I would have to say, um, like a kind of a... Christmas pudding, steam pudding. Steam we pudding. used to have a Christmas with time. peanut butter. No, no oh, peanut butter. Okay. In it. But my grandmother used to make it, and it yeah. used to be uh, you'd put it in like a double boiler, and you'd have huh. like suet. If you know what suet is, <laughs> okay, it's like yeah. a fat, a pork fat. Okay. And it's in there, and there's oh my gosh. and there's uh, uh, bread crumbs and dates, and, and it's cooked in, with steam. Um, like a Christmas cake. Yeah, yeah kind yeah, of, but it's of. a warm Christmas cake. Right. Crazy. Uh, it's like a, I think it's an English dish. Okay. So, cool. steam pudding steam with pudding. ice cream, a la mode. Oh, uh, there you go. Fancy, fancy. fancy well, fancy. thank you so much for doing this. Thanks, Bonnie. All right.